called the Keep It Real Film Review for Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Some possible spoilers, so if you haven't seen it yet, you should probably wait. But what I'm thinking about here, saw the movie last night. I was worried about seeing this. You know, Quentin, Uma Thurman's letter. She's got ties to Western Mass, so I kind of like Uma. Side with her, you know, he was pulling on the chain, he was spitting on her, making Kill Bill. Then in The Hateful Eight, Kurt Russell keeps punching the lady in the face. That was a little gratuitous, you could say. Then in this movie, end of the movie, Brad Pitt keeps smashing the lady's face. And now I get that it's a revenge fantasy, just like in Glorious Bastards. You're getting revenge on the Manson killer girls who killed Sharon Tate and her friends. Fucked up shit, we get it. But still, does that make it okay to see this gratuitous face smashing of women? I don't know, I don't know. But I think Tarantino may have some issues with women. Although he did give us that eight-year-old feminist actress. She was great, but, you know, maybe, maybe he jammed her in there to get away from the face smashing. I don't know. Maybe he doesn't even think about it. It's just the movie he wants to make. But I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong, but some of this stuff is a little excessive. Just my two cents. In the Me Too era, I don't know. But maybe I'm just getting old. I'm a wimp about violence. I'm burnt out. Great movie, though. Great movie. Uh, yeah, so that's a thought. Let me know what you think. If you saw the movie, let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know what you thought. Are you cool with everything that happened? I'm cool with it. You know, Leo with the flamethrower. That was cool. Just like in Glorious Bastards. Revenge fantasy shit. Uh, revisionist revenge fantasy, we'll call it. Historical revisionist revenge fantasy. Which is cool. Which is cool, I guess. It's cool. I didn't want to just see a reenactment of Sharon Tate and her friends getting killed. I did not want that. So, glad I didn't have to sit through that. Spoiler alert. Check it out. Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Pitt and Leo dominated. Luke Perry looked great. Damian Lewis, great. Uh, Margot Robbie, great. Everybody, great. Great, great, great. Star, 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 star. Star after star. Lena Dunham, Michael Madsen, who else you want? They were there. Pacino was doing Pacino. It was great. Great. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out.